Hello everyone, I am Aisha Dinyaga and now I'm going to read to you a beautiful poem which is entitled Phenomenal Woman by Maria Angelou. Pretty women wonder where my secret lies. I'm not cute or built to suit a fashion model size. But when I start to tell them, they think I'm telling lies. I say, it's in the reach of my arms, the span of my hips, the stride of my stiff, the curl of my lips. I'm a woman, phenomenally, phenomenal woman. That's me. I walk into a room just as cool as you please and to a man the fellow stands or fall down on their knees then they swarm around me a hive of honeybees I say it's in the fire in my eyes the flash in my teeth the swing in my waist and the joy in my feet I'm a woman phenomenally phenomenal woman that's me. Men themselves have wondered what they see in me. They try so much, but they can't touch my inner misery. When I try to show them, they say they still can't see. I say, it's in the arch of my back, the sun of my smile, the ride of my breast, the grace of my style. I'm a woman, phenomenally. Phenomenal woman, that's me. Now you understand just why my head's not bowed. I don't shout or jump about or have to talk real loud. When you see me passing, it ought to make you proud. I say, it's in the click of my heels, the bend of my hair, the palm of my hand, the need for my care. Cause I'm a woman, phenomenally, phenomenal woman. That's me. Okay, that's it. So while reading this piece, I visualize a strong, confident woman who is proud of her beauty and femininity. I comprehend the piece as a celebration of womanhood and the power of self-love. The poem speaks to the idea that women or the beauty of women is not just physical, but also comes from within. Uh, it encourages women to embrace their unique qualities and to be proud of who they are. The poem is a reminder that women are strong, capable, and beautiful in their own right, regardless of what society may say. The first line is expressing the speaker's confidence in her own beauty and power. She is saying that she may not be conventionally attractive, but she has her own unique beauty and strength that makes her a phenomenal woman. The second line is saying that when the speaker enters a room, everyone notices and it is in awe of her. She attributes her power to her eyes, teeth, ways, and feet and declares that she is a wonderful or a woman that is phenomenal. The third line is expressing the idea that people may not understand or appreciate the speaker's inner beauty and strength, but she is confident in her own power and femininity. The speaker is saying that her inner mystery is something that cannot be touched or seen, but it is expressed through her physical features and her style. She is proud of who she is and celebrates her femininity. And lastly, the fourth line is conveying that the speaker does not need to act in a way that it is overly loud or in a showy way to demonstrate her strength and worth, but that her presence should be enough to make people proud. All right, that's all. Thank you so much.